He knows we're going to this winner's round four. We got C. Palutena versus Sinji on the Pac-Man. Starting off on Battlefield, let's get right into it. Now, I want to see how C is going to deal with Sinji's game plan, right? And we, we, we can already see. Explosive flame. Explosive flame. auto radical, auto radical. You try to set up your fruit game, I will not allow you. This is what I'm going to do right now. You try to zone me, I'm going to zone you back. Animal. This is the city ordinance. You don't got a permit for that, my guy. Mm -hmm. No fruit salad being cooked up right now, but C cooking up one hell of a nair train right now. But Sinji trying to answer back right now and just trying to come on into that space. C just still shutting it down right now. Nice back to coming out. Sinji trying to get set up here at the ledge. The C already with the pressure coming back out. I love the aggressive play coming out from this Palutena. My the, the funniest thing about C and Palutena, he plays Palu like a sword character sign up, right? Like he puts that pressure yeah. on. He throws out those four years to kind of set up that space. We saw earlier when he's trying to keep Sinji away from setting up with the fruit, and it's immediately he has his own. He reclaims the uh, pace of the game, and he sets the he sets the tone. He's doing such a good job of putting that pressure on Sinji. Sinji being there, left here to pick up the pieces. Yeah, but we're going to see how Sinji is going to deal with this. Just coming back to the stage right now, avoiding the Paralyzing Fruit. That is Bell right now. And oh, catching C, committing to these Explosive Flames with the Hydrant as well. Very, very good stuff. And now you can see Sinji, I feel like Sinji is just still trying to find their footing in this game right now. You can see C really establishing their game plan right from the get-go, playing pretty, pretty aggressive. And Sinji, just, just there's no kind of answer right now. Oh, yeah, Sinji. Oh, throwing out that bell from ledge. That's the answer right there. Uh -huh. The answer is a literal bell sitting in that back pocket. Don't want that dong. Dang Welcome dong. to Taco there Bell. Go. Good morning. Good stuff for Sinji taking that first. Like, we see, already ha still has Sinji here at the ledge. Comes back down with the hydrant. What an option there from uh, from Sinji. Stone C back here at the ledge. And here we go. Up throw into up air. Nice little count. We see Pac Man can scrap a little bit here. He doesn't have, just have the setups, and he has the uh, fruit on line there, too. See, struggling to take out the stock here because Sinji's doing such a good job of playing this branch there. Right yeah, now. it's a very surprising factor because the Pac Man has a lot of very, very good aerials. But dropping to the up air, okay. Sinji's just still shaking it off, dropping down from the Angel Plant, setting up that game with the Hydra, trying to get the fruits as well. But hold up all aboard the Palutena Nair train into the up air, trying to hover for another one as well, locking it down. But Sinji, you know, having the Hydra is commanding that space still with the Water Blast. Well, there we go. Stop dash shot coming out. Sinji comes back down with the nair, catching the spot that's with the grab. You never got that Pac Man grab. Down throw into Ford. They're not going to connect there just yet. C looking to command here in the neutral state, but Sinji come back down with that very really dominant presence right now with the fruit and the hydra. C is looking for the answers, and he, he, I think he's slowly but surely like testing out his options right now. He's like playing in the training mode, but like like keeping it back at the same time. You feel me? Like. Yeah, he's, he's, this is the hand warmer. This is time to, to warm up all the buttons right now. It's that game one. With the down tilt the back here, trying to call out the jump as well. The neutral get up with the L smash. Trying to play it out again, once again at the ledge. Sinji forced to pick that option. Down rolls into the down tilt. Here we go. Back to the ledge once again, playing the situation on out. Can Sinji evade it on through? But oh, oh. not just yet. Now C is still sitting there getting that bell out of the equation. Sinji looking to make it back in the ledge. C just kept Sinji in this ledge for so long, looking to finally make his way out of the trenches. Nice to that Nair. You see still sitting there in the driver's seat, 130% on this Pac-Man. Dashag not going to do it just yet. Wow, oh my gosh. She looking to close the stock out relatively soon, but Sinji doing such a good job. Still has the oh. bell in hand. He's fell for it a third time. See, you've got to be able to sit there and play a lot more patiently this ledge as he's got up with Bell from ledge for the third time, taking the sock for the second time. Yeah, Bell is such a threatening option that Sinji honestly has pulled out in a very a lot of very good places to kind of catch C. Like, are you paying attention? Are your eyes on me? Do you see this Taco Bell? It's going to go bong if you're not ready. And setting up once again for the Hydrant at the ledge to kind of just reset the situation if it calls for it. And, oh, critical error in the grab as well. Catching that overextension as C begins that Palutena up air juggle and forcing Sinji to the ledge once again. Oh, nice run on the F smash there. And now to find that grab, unfortunately. Sinji reclaims that set of the space at the ledge. But immediately gets to throw him back. C is, like, his dominance literally just has, like, that... He just holds down the area, like, that energy with him, right? Just immediately comes back down with the aerials. With the forward air, throws himself back into neutral, trying to find that grab. But Sinji doing such a good job of kind of like playing that keep away game and holding on to these stocks as long as he can. We know that whole oh, trampoline. We're gonna find the back air, and there we go. Wow, see with a huge read. Takes that game one from Sinji. Yeah, I see what you're saying before. Let's, Politina, that's the scary thing about them. They kind of just command that like space, that respect with the back air as well. They're a very huge threatening, threatening options. It's kind of like that, you know, that sorty kind of cloud game. 
But Z's just pressure is honestly so phenomenal. It, it basically makes you feel like you're getting locked down in the prison. Like, hold up. You can't be touching these zones. These zones, this is a no-fly zone. This is a no stingy zone. You ain't allowed here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The pack is certainly not back right now, but we'll see if he makes his grand return in this game, too. Oh, yeah. See, the, the thing, like, I saw the remnants of Sinji. Like, he was doing a really good job finding those reversals around half the time. But he's letting C get that stage control way too easily, right? And like, he's really just running in and, like, throwing out these options against Sinji time and time again. Sinji just, like, he, like he, he's come back a little bit, you know, with the landing of those nares and the fares. But he hasn't done anything crazy yet. Like, he, ha he ha I know he has those Pac-Man combos in his back pocket. I know he has that Galaga in his hand right now. He definitely wants to reclaim that lead and find some big damage of his own. Yeah, right now, hold up. Invader combos coming online. Like you were saying, definitely keeping those in the back pocket. And right now, showcasing for oh, all the folks at home, mm -hmm. F-Smash him to another dimension. That's, That's that first way stock. Way too laggy, my guy. You cannot be throwing that off the ledge. Huge punish there from Sinji. Take that first stock of the game. Mm -hmm. And now, C trying to play this out off the back throw as well. You have the threat of the backers as well. But Sinji coming on with the fair challenges. I like it. Hydrant allowing him to kind of just still maintain that safe possession and playing patient in the shoe right now. Trying to catch him slacking with the fruit as well. Running on up. And oh god, he's just trying to get these near up air juggles. You see this. The tech chase as well oh. and the jab lock. Okay. Sinji putting on that work right now. Now able to find the uh, Punisher with the teleport with the down smash. See, looking to close the stock out here though, but Sinji doing such a good job of playing really defensively now, holding on to his lead as long as he can. Now to find that grab there. See, looking to close it out relatively soon. Nice catch with the explosive flame and the oh. surprise DI. Sinji did not see that coming. I didn't see it coming either. I definitely did not see that coming either. And right now, C trying to play that same game with the explosive flame as well. The auto rake was to shut down these approaches, but you cannot stop the Galaga combos coming your way. Sinji trying to read it with the F smash, not able to get it as well, but all aboard the Palutena. Nair up air to the Nair juggle right now. Still just trying to just being kept in disarray as you're forced to just challenge this character, which is such a scary menace with all these threatening options. Oh yeah, definitely. Seeing see throughout these four days, trying to find that one little that one little tap, the one little thing to do it for him. Is that oh the bell? But C grabs it for himself. Tried to go for a, a Nair dragon to a bell. I saw C he was cooking up a little. I like that. A I like that there. idea. Oh, oh okay, my okay, okay, god. All right, right, right. Oh look, my! Realizing the Hydrant's a lot closer, he's not, uh, since you wouldn't have the time to punish that. Nice adaptation there from C. Trying to, f oh, grabbing him there, down throwing the back air. Oh, trying oh. to look for the air dodge, not able to get it there in that situation. Sanji capitalizing on it right now, catching at the teleport with the fruit. And Apple of the Day is definitely keeping you away right now. Okay, yeah, C's getting away too going, throwing out these uh, F smashes there on the Hydrant. Now looking to close the stock against Sinji. Nice finding that dash act there. Oh, Sinji coming back down there with the, uh, with the up B. Yeah, a little too there. impatient on that ledge trap there. Allowing Sinji to kind of just still maintain that stock and keep his composure right in this game right now. 124. You can see C is really gunning with that stock for those S smashes here. Oh, nice. We're going to have to know with the Nair. Into the explosive flame. There we go. C has been on point with these explosive flames. Now we've got last stock scenario again. Sinji doing a lot, a little better from last game, but still, C is playing very confidently. Sinji looking to find a uh, confirm or something of the sort to be thrown on the ledge again against the Paladina. All aboard double Nair into the back air like it, just tying up very, very nice. And we're seeing that down here. That's the first time we saw that kind of come out to play. Rolling into the arms of Apollo, however, you're going to be eating a nice back air. And right now, this might be oh. Sinji's last game if he's not able to clutch it on out. Here we go, trying to find the Punisher. Nice back air on to put that pressure on the shield. Now C trying to keep Sinji at the ledge. Oh, huge off smash, but not able to find that nice, huge air dodger from Sinji. Dash attack throwing out that cross up is only doing a lot for you. What you grabbing dash attack for? That move is extremely safe, so it's definitely a hard move to challenge. You gotta know when it's coming. And right now, there might be pain coming Sinji's way right now. Uh -oh, uh -oh. SC looking to lock it down here, but oh, oh nice air dodge. dodging the bell this time around. We're playing a very dangerous oh, game. Oh, wait a minute! You can oh! see the scramble! Oh, SC alive. almost closes it out with the down smash and with the oh, counter, counter as well! Uh-oh! Oh, oh it's a oh, my gosh! Ooh. What an option! Nah, the down smash not doing it. The counter not working out for C and Sinji with the hard read on that normal get up. Throws the bell down and finds a smash tag. Sinji keeps himself alive in this winner's side. In that situation, C, the counter was the right idea, right? But you have to catch Pac-Man at kind of like the very, very end, or you have to have that counter space very, very right to be able to get that option. Mm. And so that was an extremely criti you know, critical kind of misjudgment as it, you know, 
obviously, like I said, it's a it's a committal option. You oh, yeah. lose your stage control and you risk the potential to kind of just get reversed, as we saw there. Oh, Sinji yeah. reverse C and was able to make this game three kind of happen. But right now, we switch on up, taking it to a brand new stage. This is Battlefield here. There we go. We're going to the Battlefield once again. C ended up winning game one in the stage. Sinji with the mix up there, finding the uh, game two. But now C coming back with a fence three. He's tight. He's like, wow, like my down slash didn't take the stock. My counter didn't do anything. I want this game now. I, I know this set should have been mine, and I want it to be mine. Mm -hmm, definitely making a contention for that right now. All right, up air it out onto the platforms as well. Trying to go for that hydrant to just get back to stage. It is going to work out for Sinji and almost getting his life ended off the S match as well. Still, C is cooking right now with down tilt. They're not able to get the back air as well, but they're still playing the situation out very, very well. Oh, nice go with uh Grab into down throw, the orange coming out from Sinji, looking to keep this pressure on even more. Back throw comes out, puts that pressure on the shield. C doing some good work, falling down there with the forward air. Oh, the bell is in hand. Yeah, oh, Sinji getting a little too aggressive right there. Wasting his bell at the terrible time, but now the back comes out from C, and you're on ledge against the Palutena once again uh -oh. with a huge view with that jab. I think C might be catching onto that roll that Sinji is popping on down. Oh my god! Almost having the read from the down to the explosive flame. C is playing out the situation so, so well, but Sinji coming out with the challenge, the wake up jab from the corner, and just trying to get position, serving up some fruit. Call him the Wiggles the way he be throwing those oranges, broken up that fruit, fruit salad. Oh, there we go. Comes back out. Immediately throws that back air, but that's not going to do it just yet. Sinji, the 147% still singing this ledge. I'll oh, see literally any aerial will definitely do it at this point. Sinji uh -oh. trying to make it back. Stalling for his life right now. Throwing that jump from ledge. See, waiting for the opportunity. And oh, that dash attack is going to do that. Now C reclaims the lead in this game three. Yeah, you can see both these players are very tense right now as they are playing like this is their last set on earth because kind of this is their last chance in winner's side here. C not getting hit by the bell this time, avoiding it as it goes away into play, out of play right now. It all aboard the Palu Nair train once again. 36 damage on the board and looking to eat that back here. Once again, that's 49 on the board here and oh looking to just get gosh. lots, lots more. Locking it down still with the auto radical, the explosive flame. I can see C is kind of switching back to that game plan here. Oh, there we go. Okay, Bell is uh, up smash. Shinji still finds it. The C wasn't able to cover it that off until Shinji comes back, remembers it, and immediately throws it out. Down throw to forward air, not going to do much there, though. C still is sitting comfortably with a 63% lead. Sinji, like I said, he needs a big damage combo right now. Oh, this might be what he needs. He was able to get a few damage off the invader as well. And whiffing the grab, that's going to be huge for Sinji right now. He's able to get these call outs, but there you go. Back air, the Hydra creating a ping pong situation right now. Getting that damage on up as, you know, Sinji. Oh, oh my god. there we go. C was able to actually finally get those call-outs from Sinji, kind of just getting the approaches on the Hydrant and able to get him in that Wombo combo. But now Sinji needs to do, right? Sinji needs to catch C really committing to these dash guys. He needs to catch him committing to these options as well, as you're seeing here. If you catch up onto um, his game plan, you know, shutting out that zoning and being a lot more aggressive, which you definitely can do as Pac-Man, it might net him gains. Oh, looking for the sledge driver down tilt. Air dodge coming out, but not able to find that because that air dodge is so big from Pac-Man. But that backer comes out, and now C sitting, putting Sinji onto his final stock of winner's side. It's definitely going to be tough for Sinji to make pull this out. There comes out again, though. Sinji just struggling to find any damage, any opening right now. Yeah, really good composure right now from Sinji, though. He may be reeled down a stock right now and a whole lot of percentage, but he definitely can turn it around with that one move, that one combo, that one opener. As you can see him going off to the stage right now, trying to first set that comeback item. He needs the bell, though. Will ricochet off a C shield as he's still kind of holding all this pressure here at the ledge. Oh, and there we go. Dash that comes out from C, though. Throws that hydrant down once again. See, look at close that. Oh, with the orange. There we go. Getting that orange a little wet right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Trying to cook with the orange just as well for the gun right now. But C is locked and loaded and looking to end Sinji right here, right now. Not letting the set go on any further. And you can see those teleport cancels. Those are a sign of that aggressiveness that he wants. It's done and over with. Oh, looking for the bell right now. Sinji definitely wants to hold his sock as soon as possible. But C immediately coming back down with the backer. Shielding the bell again. Yeah. Oh, wow. okay. The spot that he's still hanging on with the weak hit of the S-Nash. Not going to be doing too much. But now C, 148% all this rage in this Palutena. Down throw into up air. Not going to do it just yet. Sinji needs to take the stock yesterday. Yeah, but committing to that grab. 
I believe C was maybe looking to convert into the near to the up tilt, but all right, still keeping okay, it on lock. There we go, there we go, there we go. The up air taken off the top finally, but right now it's still things are looking very, very grim for Sinji. Sinji might need just one opening, but right now C is shutting down all those doors. The doors are slowly oh! closing, and it's out on you to go to losers. There we go. C looked for that up smash for so long, looked for it a couple times in that game one, tried to find it in that game two, and finally, after that all set of setting, preparing Sinji, trying to like that, initiating him, bro, finally finds that up smash and takes